Johns Hopkins sociologist Catherine Newman has written a book about the trend of college graduates moving back home after earning their degrees. The book is called The Accordion Family, Boomerang Kids, Anxious Parents, and the Private Toll of Global Competition. Overall, about 53% of today's college students will head home at some point after they graduate. How long they stay, what they do once they get there, that is a, there's tremendous variation there, but it's a big number. What makes it unusual is that the generation before them, their parents, didn't have this experience. And so you've got two generations side by side who have had very different economic histories. But for most young people, it's a sense that, you know, my family's here to support me. That's what families are for. And their parents, in turn, recognize that it's a legitimate function of parents to make sure that their young people are able to move up in the world the way they'd like to, and that a college degree alone is not sufficient for that. Jeremy is a recent college graduate who earned his degree and then returned to his childhood home. This generation of parents have taken a different approach that I'm not going to do what my mother and father did. I'm not going to like boot them out the door. I'm going to help them. I'm going to nurture them and, and, and be there for them. Many young people are finding that they need an internship after college or they need to take a job that doesn't pay so well to get the experience so that they will qualify for something better later. And it can be very difficult to manage all of that on top of the debt they may have as undergraduates uh, without some help from the family, which often takes the form of a roof over their heads. Honestly, it's, it was tough dealing with it at first, the whole, hey, I'm moving back home with my parents, but I was very quick to find out that a, a lot of people, a lot of my friends were doing the exact same thing that I was. So it made things a lot easier on me. The whole life course is elongating. Things that used to happen at the age of 22 are now stretching out to 25 or 27 on into the 30s. And so we don't know how long that can stretch, but we are a very um, flexible species and we are adapting to these economic conditions and to these educational demands in the best way that we know how.